Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? This is that Jack Dan back with another Every TMNT video. This one talking about every the loyal subjects, BST, AXN, or best action. So the first wave they gave us was all four of the turtles. You can see their packages here. You can see all turtles on the side, the individual turtles on the front. It says BST, AXN on the front and side there, and the top. Got the open window in the front with the name of each turtle underneath it. There's the side of that package showing that artwork with the different color of the turtle behind the figures themselves or the pictures of the characters themselves. And then here's the back of the packages showing they have 31 ports for articulation. They each come with their weapons, separate head sculpts, different hands, and a pizza. Uh, well, sorry, Donnie comes with a pizza. Leo comes with a mano cover. Mikey comes with a grappling hook. And Raph comes with a spear and a throwing star, maybe? Anyway. So there's a little closer up look at the figures and their packages. You can see all the accessories in the window as well. There's your Leo and Donnie in their package. I'll show a few images of each one of the figures, which are Raph and Mike holding their weapons with the package behind them. Your Don and Leo, packages behind them. All four turtles in action. And having a party. So again, with your Leo and Raph. Check out this nice round table of the turtles, starting off with Leo. Then you got your Mikey. Here we go with our Donnie holding his bow staff. And your Raph with his size. So pretty awesome. So again, some more shots here, show, holding both weapons, both sets of weapons, and both head sculpts there. Close up at the back, holding the weapons. Holding the bow staff there, and the pizza, and where the bow staff can hold in the back there. Standing on the sewer grate, two different head sculpts. Showing the sides in the back, holding that grate in his hands. And then holding the nunchucks there, both different head sculpts. And there is the grappling hook. Now the grappling hook is not a rope, it's just a piece of plastic, so that's kind of interesting. But there you go with the back, holding the nunchucks. We also have a exclusive for Walmart with the TMNT and their black and white with their battle damage. Coming with the exact same accessories, looks like, and head sculpts. But again, it looks like it comes in a pizza box. There's the pizza box open. You can see turtles on the inside. There's the back of the pizza box. So here is your Raph and your Mikey. And your Donnie and your Leo. And then kind of in action again. All four of the turtles. So I found this black and white version here. I believe this is a discontinued version of the Battle Damaged. All right, then we have another Walmart exclusive, 75 bucks for this thing. It's the Walmart exclusive four pack for the TMNT Foot Soldiers. See the open flap there with their Foot Soldiers will be in it. 
different color foot soldiers, which is amazing. You got your silver, orange, purple, and blue with their different weapons, their different swords. You can get out there at Walmart, check out the link in the description, uh, and still pre-order this. They all have different eye colors as well. There are the accessories they come with. Pretty awesome looking. So here we are with some renderings that we think Wave 2 is going to be with Shredder, Bebop, Foot Soldier, and Casey Jones. So there's your Bebop and Shredder renderings. So this is not the actual figure. And as you'll see here soon, it's actually not even the wave. So we'll get to that in a second. And there's your Foot Soldier and Casey renderings. And they're also re-releasing the Turtles again. So you get your Donnie, your Leo, your Mikey, and your Raph again getting released. So pretty cool. You can get these also at Big Bad Toy Store if you want to. So get on over there and check it out. So here's the actual reveals for Wave 2. And we'll see how different they are. But you got your Bebop and your Rocksteady. And also your Casey Jones. So no Foot Soldier and no Shredder here. So here's your rock steady, and you notice you actually have him in his rhino form and his human form, so you can, I guess, swap the head out. So he's got his sword or his machete that can go on his back there. He's got his rifle there, the grenade on his chest. So interesting design here. And also your bebop with both head sculpts, the pig and the human. He's got his knife, his shield, and his drill gun there. Again, got the bullets there on his chest and the necklace. So here is our Rock Steady in package. Got his gun, got his machete there, the weapons belt around his torso there. You can see the package there from the side. Rock Steady charging at you. There he is charging at you in a figure form. There's your copy or the rendering compared to the actual figure. So not too bad. Got a little bit better color on the wristband there with the spikes on it. Other than that, I don't really see a lot different, so that actually looks pretty dang good. So here's our 80s Bebop. You can see the different hand sculpts there. Human and Warthog. And package there, the card it comes with. And the back of that package. You also see in that same line, we got a crane coming here. So crane and his bubble walker, you can see it in package there. Back of the package. And you can see it does come with both stands, the tiny one and the walker. You can see the tentacles come out the front. But here's your Casey Jones and its rendering. So in my opinion, yes, the rendering looks way better. You got the rips and the knee pads there. You got your uh, colorful backpack or um, golf bag there and your colorful hockey sticks instead of the green that we're getting. And then the mask was so much more classic Casey Jones versus whatever this is that you're giving us right here. So I do have to say that they did not do very good with the Casey Jones, just in my opinion. There's Casey in package. You can see his bag there, all his different weapons. And there he is with his other mask on. So there they all are for Wave 2 with Bebop, Rocksteady, and Casey Jones. Ah, so here's that purple foot soldier. Showed up out of nowhere. He does come with a sword, lots of hands, all kinds of accessories with him, spears, guns. So very, very cool. We're getting that foot soldier, purple version. And there's our Casey Jones right there. So 
Not sure what that other version was, but this is the one we were looking for. Got the nice face mask there and also the maskless head sculpt there. Nice looking sticks in the bag. Very cool. You see him holding the bat. Got his hockey sticks in his bag he's trying to pull out. And then there's our shredder. Got his communicator, extra hands open and fisted. Got the spear, sword. So there's that spear, the sword in the other hand. Very cool. And then very interesting, there are a Raphael and a Leonardo here. Comes with the comic book here. They both have the red mask on, but they can tell the difference between them with their weapons. This is a best of best action figures line here. Got the flip cover with the Velcro there on the front. You can see the window with all the accessories in there. So here is Raphael. And from the back. Here's Leonardo, got his sewer cap. You see the flip open there as well. And there it is from the back as well. You see his swords, again with the red mask this time. And there he is in action, both of them. So here is that Michelangelo exclusive as well. See his nunchucks again, he's got the red mask on like all the others. There he is from the back. You also show the grappling hook there that he comes with. You can see Michelangelo's package here from the back and from the flipped open Velcro there. And then you have your Donatello. You got his bow staff again, the red mask. And he's got a slice of pizza. And here you can see the same for Donatello, flipped open package with the Velcro and the back of the package. So this is pretty cool. Cool, you got the arcade battle damage two-pack SDCC exclusive Bebop and Rocksteady. So you can tell from the arcade, whenever they get the battle damage, they turn that orangish color. So that was the prototype images, and here's the real images of the figures. And there they are in package, arcade damage. Bebop and Rocksteady. So you can see the artwork compared to the actual figures on the package. And there's the back of that package. Guys, there's also an arcade flashing version of Bebop and Rocksteady 2-pack here. So not just battle damage, but flashing this time. So there's the rendering of it. Back of that package. Showing the accessories that come with front of the package you see that it does come with both head sculpts as well and there's the figures in action both with the mutated and the unmutated heads and then the sides of that package so here was a previous exclusive 2022 San Diego Comic-Con glow-in-the-dark version of Casey Jones and his skull face you see how he glows with the weapons and everything and the face. And on the package itself, you can see where it says glow in the dark, so that's how you can tell the difference. Side of the package, back of the package. And there's Casey coming at you with his golf club. We have the four pack Midnight Turtles SDCC exclusive. There's the box to come in. Fresh from the shadows. All the accessories that come with. Opened up package with the Velcro in the back of the package. I'd like to shed a little light on our latest figures. There they are in action. And then we have our comic version, Mirage Comics, Casey Jones exclusive here. There's you a couple of four packs we're going to be getting. Got a couple of turtles and a couple of foot in, in these boxes. First one you can see with the four pack set one, you got your two foot soldiers and your Leo and Mikey. 
So they are in the plastic. And in battle action there. There's the foot soldiers. And then here's the second two pack with Shredder and another foot soldier. These are previews exclusives as well. Set number two. Classic comic. This one's got Raph and Donnie. You can see the accessories they come with. That is the elite foot soldier with that crazy hat on. And there's your Raph and Donnie. And your Shredder and Elite Foot Soldier. In a battle scene. Another two back here with Shredder and Elite. This time they're in the dark colors. 2022 exclusive here. There's the back of that package. Up close. Got another individual foot soldier, another 2022 exclusive GameStop. So you got your foot soldier comic shadow back of that package. And up close. Then we got our 8 bit NES Raphael exclusive. All of them actually. Mikey, Donnie, Leo as well. So the pixelated versions. Packages from the side. And here they are up close. Mikey. Donnie. Raph. These are called GameStop exclusives, looks like. Leo. Alright, next we got a SDCC photo booth here, 2022, showing all these guys in their street clothes, it looks like. Sunglasses, disguises, whatnot. All kinds of different costumes here. Didn't realize how many there were until just recently. So here's your Michelangelo street style general release. So he's got the gray jacket and the glasses and the earbuds there. Main street style. Back of that package you can see that there are four different types. You got the main style and then you got two that are one in four ch chases. And then there's a limited 100 prototype. I don't know what those look like. I haven't seen any of those prototype ones yet. Yeah, there is your Mikey in another jacket. So this is a Letterman's jacket, street style. Got the boom box, the glasses with double different uh, colors there. Comes with cards, there's the front and back of that card. And there he is with his boom box, his nunchucks. And there's a third style here. This is the windbreaker style. You see the card. Cards are specific for that type of figure. So these last two, the bomber jacket and the windbreaker, are the one in four chances. Orange glasses this time, orange jacket. Then we jump into Raph. This is the main style figure, general release. You see he's got the red glasses, the kind of cream color jacket, boom box. Then you got his Letterman jacket, which is the red jacket. Got the multicolor glasses, pizza there. Again with the card he comes with. These are one in four chance. And then you got the windbreaker here, the red windbreaker with the red glasses. And you can see the card that it comes with. And interesting that the um, animation on the front of the package is actually the general release, even though the figure inside is not that one. So there he is in that red jacket. We got Leo in the black jacket. This is the general release. Blue glasses, communicator, the size. Then you got his Letterman jacket with a skateboard, colorful glasses. There's the card it comes with. And then you got the windbreaker version of Leo. Comes with that sewer cover. There's the card it comes with, front and back. And then lastly, we have Donnie in his main release here. He's got a video camera. He's got the brown jacket. And he's got his Letterman jacket. 
colorful glasses. There's the cards he comes with. Card, I should say, front and back. And then you got his windbreaker version. So there's all those different versions. Again, I never found the prototype pictures of that fourth version that you could get for each, but there's the three of each that I did see. A little turnaround here of each. This is the general. This is the letterman jacket. And then we got the windbreaker version. So definitely different options there for you with each one of these street style versions. And again, there's you can mix and match whatever you want to find. Put them in all kinds of different poses. There's your Raph. Your Leo, your Mikey, and your Donnie, different kinds. Let's go flip through all the cards for each ones, except again that prototype style. Still don't know what those are going to look like. Don't know when they're going to release, if they already have. Yeah, there's the cards front and back for each one of these. Pretty cool. Alright, then we got a arcade damage Android Crane version. This is an extra large figure. You see the crane can come out of the body. So that's a nice one. We have a Slash, April, and Casey Jones Urban Legend coming soon. So there's all the accessories they come with. So you can see the artwork on Slash, the weapons he comes with, the shell right there on the back side with the spikes on it, the one eye. Nice artwork on the package there as well for best action. There's all the weapons he does come with. And then with April, you see her in package here, all the accessories she does come with, the microphone, the headset, the extra head, the extra hands, the gun, the camcorder. There she is with all that. And then you got your Urban Legends Casey Jones with the Stars and Stripes mask, the regular hockey mask, the, the case there to hold it, the bat with the nails in it. Pretty cool. And then we got another Android body crane, regular release instead of the battle damage. So it says XL on it as well. There's the sides and the back of the packages. Exact same figure, just this time regular colors. So Crane can come out of the body on this as well. There it is in package. All the accessories. Blasters, the sword, and in battle with the turtles. New shot of Raphael on a bike from the Loyal Subjects, $49.99 for this figure. Alright, so here we see the toy book reveal that we have a blue bike for Leo. And you also see a raft there with a size and a helmeted head. So we know that raft will be released as a Target exclusive. Red, Target, makes sense. Leonardo in his blue outfit will be released as a Walmart exclusive. Blue, Walmart, there you see Leo in his helmet as well. You see the smoke effect coming out of the tires there, looks pretty cool. 5 inch scale figures and there's both of them on their bikes but what 
we haven't seen yet is Mikey on his orange bike, which will be Target, and Donnie on his purple bike, which will be Walmart, coming later this fall. All right, so you see Best Action TMNT Wave 4 only at Target, Target exclusives. And I know it's hard to tell, but this is a different version of Crane. His walker is actually a metallic purple. It's going to be a Target exclusive. And it's called Crane Vein Crangazoid. Along with this, at Target, we'll have a orange booted April O'Neil in, in her yellow jumpsuit. And there'll be another variant of Casey. He will be in monochrome. And along with that, starting off with April here. Got a scared head, regular head, in her yellow costume there with the camera, the headset, the microphone, and a gun. There you see 31 points of articulation, comes with the card, limited edition collector's cards. Channel 6 microphone there. There's that card she comes with. Got the gun, the camera. Next we have the Battle Damage Casey Jones here. This is awesome looking, black and white, except for the colored mask and the blood. Really cool looking figure there. You can see all the weapons he comes with on the back there. Front and back of that package. Got the regular mask as well. So yeah, nice couple of head sculpts, best action. And all those weapons he comes with. Then we have a Street Thug Rocksteady. You can see the card he comes with. Does come with the regular human head as well, regular human hands, the gun, the machete, and it's got a foot on the side of his shoulder there. There's the card. And there it is with the human look as well. And in package. Then we have a slash figure here. You can see the card, the package, and you see on the front this is a glow in the dark figure. Got his gun, it's sharp spikes on his shell there you see the card has shown in glow and dark so is the back all the accessories he comes with extra hands in the package there with the backpack too and then you can see him glowing a little tease here of new waves that are coming for these five inch tmnt best action figures so you get the four pack with the turtles themselves and also we're going to be getting a set that we've talked about with the motorcycles but we're also getting this shredder figure too it looks like so here is your sdcc 2023 previews exclusive figure set here of the four turtles leo in action here there's the card he comes with in package and you get your Donnie here with his goggles on he's a lot more skinny got the gauntlet on his arm as well you can see on the package his little super cover that's showing it's a limited edition collector collection cards there inside and it's a 2023 exclusive there it is in package the card massive gauntlet whatever that thing is storage on the back of the shelf for the, the bow staff Get your Raphael here, got his size, got some couple of three of the throwing stars on his chest there that you can take off as well. Really cool looking. In package, got the card, you can see the storage on the back for the saw. Cool looking figure. Then you got Mikey here with his winking eye, got his nunchucks all taped up everywhere. Nice package for him as well. Looking kind of young with this figure. There's the card. So yeah, Michelangelo. All right, looking like we got an arcade version, pixelated GameStop exclusive, I believe, with the four turtles. You can see that pixelation on them. Here's Leo up front, arcade game, Leo. And again, there's a little red circle. It looks like it's saying GameStop exclusive there. Front and back of the package, you can see Leo lit up there as if you're selecting him as his character. He's got a sewer cover there get your katanas L on the belt and like I said check out that pixelation got your Donnie arcade game you can see Donnie is selected on the back there shows all the accessories it comes with there and that little little bubble on the back of the package again GameStop exclusive little 
red circle there on the front. And you see his katana, or sorry, his bow staff with the purple tape on there. So that's pretty cool. Stores in the back. Got a piece of pizza. You have your Michelangelo select on the back there. Mikey. GameStop exclusive. You can see the hands, extra hands, extra head sculpt he comes with. And he has both sets of nunchucks and this other grappling hook type thing. And we have Raph. Arcade game, GameStop exclusive. Comes with all these accessories. And there you see on the back, Raph is selected. Has the extra head sculpts, extra hands, extra weapons there, including the throwing star. But he does have his size. That you can store in the back. Alright, so SDCC 2023 shut off some more of the best action from the loyal subjects. The prices, what day they were going to be revealed or up for order or pick up, whatever you want to call it. So first off we had the Toka and Rezar arcade colors, $30 each. So here those are, plus the regular versions of the Toka and Rezar as well. 23 SDCC exclusives with the RK colors. Toka first. Razar. Got the cards that come with them. The weapons. So there is Toka's front and back of the card sides of the packages there you can see it says 2023 SDCC exclusive and package there front and back figure from all angles here got the articulated jaw the foot on the belt and the skulls there's Razar same thing sides of the package you can see the SDCC 2023 on the label cards Front and back. Front and back of the package. You can see them in the plastic. And figure from all angles there. All right, here we go with two different versions of the Turtles. You have your STCC 2023 exclusives, comic book series black and white variants, but you also got the comic book series battle ready variants. So there's that black and white series, plus you got the color on the masks and the weapons. That's awesome. You see those were revealed the same day, at least Donnie and Leo were. There's the box, four pack here. Side and back of the package. Nice artwork there. And in package, you can see them in the plastic and loose. I love the look at these turtles. Got the wrapping around their feet and their hands. So there's Donnie from the back with the card. His uh, mask on his face there and his gauntlet. Back of the card. Leo from the front of the card, see the size on his back there, back of the card, you got Mikey, nunchucks, stored in the back there, that's cool, and you got Raph here with his size, angry face, 
Uh, next we got the 2023 exclusive uh, Glow in the Dark Super Shredder XL. And also Raph with his golden motorcycle. So very cool motorcycle there with him. And there is the other turtles, Mikey and Raph, that came out the same day as the Shredder and, and the uh, motorcycle Raph. Here's that Glow in the Dark Super Shredder XL, 8 inch figure. The flame effect piece there, extra hands. Card front and back. In package. Comes with the sword there as well, massive sword. And there's your bike there, the gold bike, very cool with the card. Front and back. Side of the package there, you can see SDCC on these packages as well. Limited edition. In package there. Back of the package. You can see the accessories that it comes with there on the back of that box. And here he is standing next to the bike and on the bike. Bike seems a little small, but got the uh, smoke effect piece there on the back of the tire. We have our Loyal Subjects 8 inch Android body. Got the flipping open there with the Velcro. Accessories on the arms you can switch out. Back of that package. Shows all those accessories he has. Crane can actually come out of the body there. You can see the tentacles stayed like he's controlling it still. And there it is in package. Crane's in there kind of sideways. That's kind of ugly. Got your limited edition Raphael on his red bike this time. Smoke effect as well. Got the black helmet this time. It is available at Target. First time seeing our shredder here in package. IDW version here. And here's some official images of the IDW shredder. Red cape, all kinds of weapons there, extra head there, regular head, back of the package. Sword as well. I'm not sure what those other weapons are called. There he is with the regular head and the sideburns there on the head. Got some um, bandanas there for the turtles. I don't think it comes with that. There's a card front and back. Alright, so here is a Shredder in Hail IDW comic. Comes with the comic book as well. Two different head sculpts. You can see it opens up, you can see that figure in box. Nice artwork on the box itself. There it is with an axe, a sword, extra hands, effect pieces. Comes with the comic book, number one, IDW. Back of that package. There he is with his axe. His regular head sculpt. The effect pieces there are like virtual spikes on his hands. That's kind of interesting. But yeah, that's a pretty cool looking helmet there for him. And jumping into action with some slash action as well. You gotta love these bikes that they're getting for these turtles. That's awesome. Turtles themselves are cool. Alright, here's our 8 inch best action XL 
Super Shredder here. Eight inches tall, like I said, from the 90s. Super Shredder here in package with the, fl the uh, Velcro flip cover. There he is from the side holding his sword. You can see inside the package there, showing it comes with a comic book as well from IDW. Front and back of that package. All the accessories he comes with shown there on the package. There he is in the package. You can see those accessories, extra hands. There's that comic book. And here's that effect piece there coming out of his hands. The blades on the hands. The sword, the mace. Lots of spikes everywhere. Alright, so here's our first little tease to the best action Raphael from Mateus Santaloco. Got the figure in the comic in this box. Alright, so here we got another Raphael on bike. This one's got a metallic candy coat on it. You see it glows in the dark as well to the mask and the bike there. Lights glow in the dark with candy coat motorcycle. Here's the package, front and back, the side as well. With the bike there in front, you can flip up the helmet. You have the hel helmet on or off of him. The bandana flying. There's the card he comes with. On the bike there, mouth open. Got the size that can be stored on his back. Got the kickstand for the bike. From the front there. Jump it into action. Bike from all angles. And there you can see it glowing. All right, here's our comic figure sets here. Leonardo and Michelangelo boxes here. So there's your Leonardo, front of the box, side of the box. The katanas with the flame effects on them and without. The bandana flying in the wind. Inside of the package, back side of the package. Here's your Michelangelo. Got the two nunchucks, two different head sculpts, inside of the package, side of the package, back of the package. Here's our Donatello, front and back of that box. There's the inside of the box, Velcro holding it in. There he is loose, the bow staff. Got his goggles, his gauntlet on his arm as well. Got your Raphael, front and back of that box. Inside, again with the Velcro. Got the two sides. And do store in the back as well. And all four turtles. So here's our first look at Rat King Glow in the Dark and also at Alopex Vigilante which is a darker color scheme here you'll see. And this right here has got a lighter color scheme with the blue for Alopex. And there's your Rat King figure. Alright so here's your Alopex. You see the card there. It's got the gray costume this time. Different head sculpts. Here you see the Alapex gray costume in package, Vigilante, Target exclusive. Front and back of the package. Along with Rat King there. Front and back of the package for Alapex. There's that card front and back. I love that sitting pose, it's cool. Target, you see the accessories. There's your Rat King. Very interesting look for Rat King there. Got the flute. 
Front and back of that package. Looks like he's glowing in the dark. Front and back of that card. With his rats. His bald head and long hair. Two different head sculpts. There's all those accessories. Alright, so here we have a Jenica tease. Got the claws on the hand there. There she is in package. There's the official. All angles of that package. In the back there. The card front and back. Got some effect pieces there for the claws. Got a little sword there too. If you see these whited out eyes, there's another set of eyes that you can actually see. Here's your foot assassin, front and back of that package. Long claws, front and back of the card. There's that red mask with the slashes on it. And without the slashes, some two different head sculpts. Got your Undead Turtles 4-pack here. That was that box I teased earlier, I guess. There's front and back of that package. There they are in the plastic. And in the box. Cards for each. is Mikey winking at us. Raph throwing his stars. Donnie with his gear. And Leo with his flaming sword. That's awesome. It's a very cool wave there. Got another one coming here. With your SDCC exclusive for 2024. The Foot Elite. And Jenica. Battle ready. Foot Elite is Comic Noir. So there's your Foot Elite. Crazy looking mask there. Front and back of the car, back of the package. He has an extra head sculpt there. So you got the hooded and you got the one with the hat on. That is a nice looking sculpt head. Here's your other Jenica, Battle Ready. Back of that package. You can see those two different eyes I was talking about earlier. One with the mask on, one with it off. Still got the effect pieces that comes with her. Got a two-pack here with Metalhead and Donatello for SDCC. Glow in the dark. That's a very cool two-pack. Donnie with a lot of his weapons, accessories, and tools. And Metalhead with skates. That is awesome. There's the back of that package. Donatello looking like he's working on him. Front and back, or front of the cards for both. Back of the cards for both. And there he is on the wheels. That is awesome. Again with the tools for Donnie. Working on him. And there's those wheels. That is awesome. And he glows in the dark. Even better. Look at all that detail on the chest. Got our Battle Ready Dark Leonardo SDCC exclusive. And our Glow in the Dark Shredder the Dreamer SDCC exclusive 2024. Got our Macy's exclusive. Turtles here. Glow in the dark, undead. Individually packaged. Raph and Leo. Donnie and Mike. Can you see it says created for Macy's and you see glow in the dark, Raphael. Michelangelo. 
Leonardo. And Donatello. Got your Big Bad Toy Store 25th Anniversary. Dark Leonardo Battle Ready. Front and back of that. Card, front and back. And there is that figure. All geared up. Two different head sculpts. Guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Leave me any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you're ready. Hit that thumbs up, and I'll talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.